All right. We got our next match, guys. From bad thoughts and bad shots, we missed. Uh, we have on the left hand lagging, Mr. Jeff James, and Jeff's coming in as a seven, one of the better players on the league, and his teammate, or excuse me, from stroke and, pour, and pray, looks like it's uh, team captain Mark Murphy who's coming in as a five. <laughs> all right, this should be a good match. Jeff James is what we all aspire to be. Good player, great position. I think uh, player. I think on this game, on this match right here, I think Jeff only has to go to, correct me if I'm wrong, five, and his opponent has to only win three matches. Yep. Yeah. What's Jeff a seven? He is. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, let's see what Jeffrey does here. He played a 10 ball. Yep, stop Come it. off the rail for the 12. Yeah, draw it back just a tad. Take care of that 9 and 13. Yeah, I think the 15 is his last ball going in the side and 14 in the Nine corner. 13. Coming across the table. Yeah, too much. Wow. That was uncharacteristic. That's why I like taking that 12 ball and doing a little nip jaw shot. And then get the four, then get that one that he just made in the nine. Take the four, 15 in the side, drift down it for the 14, eight in the corner, corner pocket. Okay, you should play the two next, and then the three seven. Nope. I actually like taking the, where he is. I actually like taking that. What's that next to that five ball? What is that? The four in the side. Uh-oh. He jumped on that one. Table two gotcha. Can't hit the side rail. They won't go in. No. <clears throat> we'll see that with Jeffrey, though. He's going to fire this 15 in. Well, the problem is uh, that 14 now. He's going to play the 14 right now. Right. Side. Yeah, he's going to try to just lob, lob it in. Yeah, yeah that's an easy tough. shot from there. Yeah. Now I'll play the 15, come down for the 12. Have a nice angle to go to drift to the rail, short rail, and come out for the nine. Center of the table. Unless he comes two rails. Yeah, he's just going to come across one rail. Oh, he's playing the nine. Oh, he's going to play the 12. Yeah, I don't like this shot right here. I don't play the 12 first. He's got he's to put a lot of spin on him, a lot of bottom right, come down three rails. Yeah. I don't think he's worried. Well, he had to get down there to try to get down that for that eight ball in the side pocket or into or the corner pocket. I actually put a little bit too much English, a little bit too much spin on it, and that's the reason why he missed that. Mark shooting a little quick. Well, it's the first game, you know what I mean? <laughs> Slow down a little bit. Think about your shots. What I don't like about this, if he takes it, that three, he, he he better be able to draw it back, because uh, if he doesn't, he's going to be in a bad spot. He can cut the three and make this and get a nice angle for the seven afterwards. Yeah, that's what he's going. He's got to be careful he's not to scratch. The first. Yeah, that's a good shot. <clears throat> yeah, I like that shot. That was a great shot. Four ball now can take him the side. Follow that up for the five. He's got to be careful he's here. Playing the five. Now. It's a tight fit. Nice shot. Now he's going to play the one and come down the table for the four. Yeah. He should have this one locked in there. Not too hard or not too easy. It's a good friend of mine would once say. It's a speed shot. Oh. Wow. Wow, he stopped in a good spot. Sure did. Yeah, he did. Jeffrey will make it off the rail. No, I don't think it will go, Chris. Yeah, he's got to... He's going to kick it. Yeah, he's got to kick it. 
You're still going to come off the long rail. This should be a good jump shot. You can get jump shots. Oh, yeah, Chris can jump. I mean, uh, Jeff can jump. Oh, I know he can. He, he does want to come off the rail, though. Hey, let's go two rails. Come yeah. off the short rail and the long rail. <clears throat> come right off right around, right below the second diamond. Yeah, because he's got to get a little position on that eight ball. Yeah, and I'll slide the cue ball right across the table. No, way, way. Yeah, he, well, he had too much right-hand spin on it. Yeah, he didn't need any. Eh, yeah, I, yeah, you're right. I, I, I agree with that. Well, stop shot. Bring it. Draw back just a tad. If if he doesn't draw it back, and he and he gets out of line on that four, that's why. Let's see. He just wants to bring it back a couple inches. That's why I like I like taking the uh, one in the opposite side with top. Mm -hmm. See, he's almost in no man's land right now. He's gonna, he's gonna kind of. He's gonna hit bottom left and try to come down for the three. That was nice. Nice angle. A little bit of top should come right out for the eight ball in the other corner. Sorry. Or you could just tap it in, and take the eight in the side pocket, right where he's shooting from. Yep. Yeah, beautiful shot. Just nice shot. Yeah. Yep. Right yep. uh, uh, we got a ball game. Okay. Mark Murphy won. Joff James Zippo. I shoot Mark. It is. I'm just going to shoot the six ball. I should never know with him. No, nope, he's not. Well, the reason why he's, he has to shoot over a ball, so this is an easier shot. Looks like he's taking that 11 ball. Yep. 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 The five blocked the pocket, though, with one and nine to go, but that's all right. It definitely made it a little difficult. Play that 14 all the way up. A little bit of left-hand English. Wow. I'm just going to shoot this three ball, pull a little bit forward for the six. Should be able to get a nice angle off the six, come back up table for the two in the same pocket. Unlimited coaching from the sideline. Unlimited coaching. Twice, twice approaching the table. But isn't there like a limit though? No. To be unlimited from the sideline. Oh, not anymore. I would have that. Thank you. Nice shot, Mark. Yeah, we read that in the rule book. However, 
you can't have, and we've had this. But the coach can't approach him. No. You can't have the whole team yelling instructions. Right. That falls under sideline interference. Okay. Yes. One person, the team captain, whoever the designated coach That's right. Now, someone can call that coach off to the side and give him advice. Yeah. But you can't have the whole team yelling at advice. That's right. Oh, Mark's uh, going to town on Jeff here. Uh-oh. Well, I think he's got it. He's going to make the eight ball. Oh, he's listening to his iPhone, but boy. <laughs> Let's get some positive uh, shooting going on. Yeah, he doesn't want to slam this. Just nice and drifted in. Yep. Missed it. I think that was uh, the pressure. <laughs> you know what? I like where, Je this, where Jeff is right now on this because that, that fourth, that, he's going to leave that 13 right there. You think? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Dude>. Would you? <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, I'd probably bank it right now. Who knows? As crazy as I shoot. Okay, he's just gonna he, 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 he's just gonna drift down here. Yeah, yeah he, he played he, safe. Yeah, he played it safe. I like that shot. That was a good shot. Yeah, I think it was the right shot. Yeah, now he's gonna come off behind and hit the eight if he can. Well what's, gonna, spin it. well, what's going to happen if he if he doesn't hit it, Chris? Uh, Jeff's going to go ahead and put ball in hand. He's going to take that thirteen out of there and put it in the corner pocket. I think he's I think he's got to go all out. Yeah, and then he'll run out once he has ball in hand. Oh, he should. How's he doing? Oh, Whoop. well, okay. Well, let's see if he does do that. Oh, nice to see what he was doing. Put the 13 on the side and follow it up for the 9. Put a 9 ball. He, I think he's yeah. starting to drive back to the touch. Play whatever that ball is here on the rail. Don't play the 14, I'm sorry. Yeah, and 10 in the side. Yeah. yeah, he's got this one. It's just going to drop back just a tad. I don't know what that ball is on the rail closest to us. Is it 12 or 14? Yeah. This What a big change of events. Bottom. Come right back. Yep. Float the 10 in. Eight in the corner. He's just going to stop shot it. There He's going to make it. Yeah. Oh, I bet you Mike uh, wants this one back. Yep. You know what he? You know, I was watching when Mike was shooting that eight ball, Chris, and he actually was putting English on the ball when he really didn't even have to put any English. He was putting uh, uh, right uh, right English on there, so he was actually putting uh, inside on it, and it, and that's why the eight ball went to the left. He didn't even have to hit any English on it. You know, the majority of the pool players have no idea where center cue ball is. Well, I've heard that time and time again from major and major. Uh, league instructors that people do not know where center is on the cue ball. Well, what happens is they you, get, you have an idea where it is, but when you think you're hitting the center ball, you're actually not hitting the center ball. Well, yeah, because yeah. your stroke's not straight. Exactly, you got a little wobble your in your stroke. Off. Yep, yep so many different variables. Yep, that's a good point. Okay, we got one one here. That's why a good drill to do is that one where you use a stripe and you shoot it down the table and have it come back on your tip to see if you can stroke straight. Most yeah. people can't do that. Yeah, that's that's a drill. Start off on the short rail, back and forth, and then go up long long rail. Okay, let's see what he did. Uh, beautiful break. That eight ball didn't go nowhere. Oh, look at all these balls moving he around. Anything. Oh, boy. Make a ball. Hey, he's got one shot, and uh, Mike's going to go ahead and take that 10 ball. Yep. And then he's going to take the 14. Just tap it and take the 14. Hopefully, get straight in on the 14. Draw it back a little bit for the 12 in the side. The 12 ball is the key ball right there. Yeah, but the 9 ball is tied up on yeah. 3, so he's I, not going anywhere. Yeah, I think he came up too much. He's going to try to play 12 now. Well, he has to. He's going to try to draw it back. Yeah. He's shooting pretty good. He stopped this one for the 9 in the corner. No, oh, he jarred it. Well, he didn't. Still didn't leave him a lot. Yeah, I think he might have that five ball. I can't see just in the way. Oh, yeah, he's got the five all day long. Twice on Sunday. 
overcut it. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Well. Okay. Well, he's got that thirteen. He's kind of straight in. If he can stop it, though, he can play the 11 on the side. But it looks like there's a slight angle to it. I can't tell, really. No, I think it's it might be straight in, but I, I, I do think he just needs to kind of stop shot it. He's punch out for the 9. It's not too bad. Well, if he can play the 11, that'd be even better. Play the 11, then the 9. He fall down. Well, he, he might be able to go uh, off the rail. For, oh, yeah. The, oh, there's the nine. I didn't even see the nine there, Chris. Yeah. He, he, he wants to tap that. Very easy. Wrong, Too much. Wrong English. Way wrong English. No. Rushing the shot just a tad. Yep. He was standing up before he followed through on the ball. Yeah, you want to stay down on your shot, folks. <clears throat> An error everybody does from the pros to the to the low players. Hey, I don't do those mistakes up here in the booth. I don't miss. I, I don't you miss, don't miss anything from the booth. Yeah. Well, I miss from the booth. Okay. He's going to stop shot this ball and take the seven inside. Excuse me, all the way down the corner pocket. Then take the five. Drop back for the six. Six and the four in the same pocket. You gonna go around the world here? No, I'm just drawing back. I, I don't like going around the world he's here. He's just drawing back. Oh no, he's drawing around the world. Nice speed control. Look at that. That was beautiful. As he draws straight he, back off the floor. Well, he he can punch it over, and so to take the six in the side. And draw it back, play the six in the corner, come straight across the table and play the six, the eight in the same pocket. And we're just going to hold it up, play it in the other pocket. No, I just saw the pictures. I went to... Oh, that's it. And that'll give Jeffrey two to one. Two to one. Yeah, that's it. Two one. Doesn't Mark have two? No, he has one. He he should have won the second game, but he won the very first match, and that was it. Oh, okay. That's right. He missed that eight ball. Yeah, he's kicking him. He's going to remember that one. But pool, you know, you got to you, you know, you got to put it behind you. And move on. Well, I, didn't, I didn't know that before, but Jeff just started. You know when Jeff started wearing a glove? I've never seen him with a glove before. I have no idea. <clears throat> I wear a glove. Yes, please, sir. I've seen you on Facebook a little bit. I know, you can. <laughs> <laughs> is it still open? I'll get out of your way. No. You bet. Mr. James has got the low ball solids. He's going to try to ro I think he should take that one all the way up in the corner pocket. Yep. And come out across the table. Well, if he if he hits it right, he might run into the ten and the seven. That's what I think he's looking to do. Yeah, that's what he's looking to do, but he didn't make it. Nice shot. Well, he can play the seven right inside. Uh, I don't. I don't. Does that go over there? It doesn't look like. Looks he like can. there's a gap between them. Oh yeah, there was. Just 
follow a little bit off the six. He got out of line there. That's okay. He's 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 going to take that uh, four ball in the corner pocket and run into the five ball. I think he's going to shoot a three ball. I mean, he might take the. I think the four is the shot. The only problem is the cue ball goes all up the other end of the table, but I guess he's going to shoot that. Well, he's going to try to use that five as a stopper. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. Max in the driver's seat. Did you play the 14 here or the 10 on the side? Put the 14 all the way down and then play no. for the. Uh, I would. I would take. The, I would take the 10. You take the 10? Yeah, and then I'd take the 11. You push the 14 closer down towards the... No, oh, well, if you drift down and everything, you just do a stop shot on the tw on the 11 in the side, and then you have the 14. He's on a little bit of, uh, of an angle here, so I, you can get in a lot of trouble on this shot. He's looking to play that 10. Oh, I played a 14 on the side. If I played a 14, I played a 12. Whatever that ball is on the side. He's in a pickle. Hmm? I'm sure he makes the 13 in the corner. Maybe. I don't. Oh, yeah. It, oh, there was a 9 ball there. I didn't even see that. Yeah, yeah. That made it easier. If, if, if he can make this 14, Chris, put a little top. Put a little bit of top on it, come off the rail when you're up to 13. That's a nice shot. Just got to be careful with this. Take your time. Nope. Nope. Oh, big pocket with a four ball there. Yeah. Oh, I like this. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Think. You know, he's in perfect position here. He's yeah, he's got a nice angle off that 12 ball to the eight ball. Yeah. Just got to roll it in. Just got to slow roll it. Got to concentrate on making the ball. Yeah. Get the cue ball to bounce off the long rail just a little bit and be good. Just like that. Perfect. Yep, perfect. I, I bet you he takes his time on this one. What do you think? Hope so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that's it. All right. We got 2-2, two -two, right? 2-2. Two -two. And uh, Mr. Mark Murphy is on the hill. Oh, is he? He is. Jeff's, uh, you know, the thing is uh, with with Jeff, you know, he, he's got to play smart towards the end. Don't leave them last balls hanging. The play. shooting mark. I'll be right back, Chris. Party break. Jen, you want to commentate on Just Matt? Don't swear. 
do I do? Just put your headphones in. That's... Well, we got a treat for you, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> we get the one and only blonde bombshell of busters. Miss Jen Day is sitting in. Oh, excuse me, Jen Brown, excuse me. <laughs> and she's going to commentate on her boyfriend's match, Mr. Jeff James, who is not doing so good. Just talking to the mic. Talking to the mic. I'm scared. Hey, you know what? Jen, say hello to the people. Hi. <laughs> I'm too scared. Oh, come on. Well, I want it like this. Well, have it like that. I don't care which way you have it. So, how, did you play tonight yet? Not yet. Not yet? Are you a four now? Nope. Five? Three, Three? Three still. <clears throat> Jen's game's come a long ways. She started playing, uh, really digging in later part of the last year. <laughs> Game's doing really well. Um, Jeff's opponent, he's playing Mark Murphy, and he's on the hill. Jeff has two, and he has, um, I, gotta go on the I practice think, three. Mm. I got to go on the practice table. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Root your boyfriend on. <laughs> he needs some encouragement here. She's a little shy. We'll get her later on this year. <laughs> Almost got her. I got a word out of her. Hi. <laughs> okay, I'm back, guys. All right. Had a nature call. I tried to get Miss Jen Day on. Uh, Jen Brown, excuse me. Well, I, I saw her on... Uh, on the booth here, but did uh, she commentate? She went, hi. Hi? <laughs> okay. Hey, that's more than some people, Chris. You know that. Hey, I mentioned I said, you want to come just commentate? Je whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow. That was close. For that somebody that's on the hill, that was not <laughs> what you want to do. I think he's... Uh, I almost had heart failure right there. Well, I think he's going to go buy a lottery ticket tonight. He's got a lot of balls to run, but I mean, it's pretty spaced out. Yeah, t I, I like taking the seven after this with an angle. Absolutely. Uh, I, well, the worst thing you can do in a pool is get flat on a ball, because angles get you everywhere. Well, he's a little bit minimal effort. He 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 could have used a little bit of angle on this. He's going to put a lot of right hand spin on this. Nope, not enough. Well, he's got the four. Well, no, he's got the one. Who's the one? Yeah, the one. Oh, I see them taking the four here. Nah, take the one. Take the easiest shot, and then come all the way down for the four. And the, the three should be his out ball. No. Nope. Yeah, see, that was the shot. And what would have happened is he would have came all the way down towards the middle of the table and he had that uh, four ball in the corner. Can Jeff squeak the nine by the eight? I don't think so. He's going to bank it. Oh, that's a dead bank. It's a nominator right here. Uh, yeah, I think no English. Hit it solid. Like that? Yes. Yeah, that was a gimme. Would have shot that one all day long. Yeah. Okay. All right, so Jeff's got three and he's got two. Correct. And, uh, yeah. Jeff needs two and he needs one, correct? Yeah, uh, you got it. Let's race five to three. <laughs> I'm pretty sore. My legs are sore, Chris. I ran in the, the James Foley 5K race Saturday over here in Rochester. Oh, cool. There was 1,300 runners. Yeah, I'm not a I'm not a runner, you know. I I go work out a little bit, but I pushed myself, and uh, my goal was just to try to see if I could just maintain a pace, not stop, and I accomplished that goal and came Fully in. Going to run too? Oh yeah, yeah. My wife ran, and uh, we had a little bet going on on who was going to cross the finish line first. Loser did dishes that night. The loser had to give the other uh, person a 15-minute back rub. 
<laughs> I won. <laughs> but it was fun. It was uh, a lot of dignitaries there. I got a picture with, uh, you know, Kelly Ayotte and Miss New Hampshire. She was there. Very pretty young lady. And there was 1,300, a little over 1,300 runners supporting uh, the Jim Foley Foundation who died by the hands of ISIS a couple years ago. Yes, I was a photographer that... Mm. The cowards took out. Yeah, that's right. But it's uh, goes on. It's the second year that they had it, and they have a, had a much more turnout. Like five hundred more p- people turned out this year. That's good. I think he was trying to run into something there. Yeah. Um, I, well, he, he jammed he's, up here. He's in a pickle. He's trying something crazy. I don't know what he's trying. Well, he actually made a good hit. Was it a good hit? I think it was. Yeah. I couldn't see him when he was shooting, but I was looking at the monitor, Chris. I was looking at the table. Oh, wow. Well, I, Jeff's I not picking up the cue ball, so it must have been a good hit. Yeah, it was a good hit. It was a great hit. I made just completely 11 up in the corner. No, I don't know. I like playing a safety here, just tapping into the uh, 10 ball and dr- drifting it back down on the short rail where the emblem is. You can't cut the 9 all the way up. No, nah, no, nah, you don't want to do that. Oh, that's what he's trying. Yeah, I was surprised. He didn't give him anything. I mean, no. he doesn't really have anything. The 6 ball's tied on the 15. The 2 ball doesn't really go, and the 5 ball's kind of blocked up. No, he can make that 6. Oh, we can? Yep. Okay. He's going to slice the two. Uh, I don't know. I think he's in a pickle. I'd play safe here. Yeah, I would too. He didn't no, leave the cue ball. Oh, oh, what are you trying uh, he came up two stroked it and he just. Well, Jeff's in the driver's seat. He, he's going to play a safety here. Oh, I would, yeah, definitely. I'd play. Play the 10 ball closer to the pocket and try to leave the cue ball behind the 11 on the short rail. I actually like hitting the 9 ball off the rail and getting it in the middle of the table in front of the side pocket. Yeah, that's true because he can't make anything with the 5 or the 2 anyway. That's right. So I think he's going with what I said. Yeah. Either either one will probably be acceptable. Yeah, but the 9 ball being off the rail is always a nice plus. Yep. Yeah, that's okay. <clears throat> yeah, just like that. Use the two as a stopper. Play the 11. 13. Chop the hands off. Jeff, she's playing a little dangerous game tonight. What's up, Jeremy? It's a tough shot. Yeah, he's shooting over a ball. Yeah, he's yeah. got to be careful because he, if he leaves a shot on that uh, side shot for that five ball, I think he's just got to tap it. That five ball cutting it in is a tough shot. Yeah. I wow. think. Looking at the picture here on the side screen, it's quite a cut. I think he needs to do it. I think it will go. I think it will go. I just think it's a tough cut. It's not a gimme by any stretch. Oh, no. Yeah, I didn't think it was that easy. Should take a little bit more time. Just cut the 14, I think, down in the corner. Oh, absolutely. Probably put a little bottom left on it. Spin it to the right. Nice speed control. Nice speed control. Play the 13, throw it down to the rail to the 15. I want to play the 10 and the 15. Let me stop shot it. Oh, he's going to come off the rail. Always maintaining that 10 to 15 degree angle. Put a bit of 
Well, he's kind of draw it back into the middle of the table towards the side pocket. Shooting over a ball. And a play the eight in the corner. And then puts it on the Hill Hill match. It is. Hill Hill, the way we like it. Gotta say, I love seeing Buster's full like this. It's great. Reminds me of the old days. Every table going. Yep, we got Just a lot. Just need to have a line out the door. Yep. Give Frank a call down here at 692-7926. We're on uh, Route 108, Summersworth, New Hampshire's Buster's Billiards. Come on down, guys. I think he came up dry. Uh, I think he, you. I think you're right. It's not that good of a break. A lot of clustering. Hey, Dennis. He's going to play the one ball. He's going to play the seven five. So he's going to play the five straight up. And it's amazing how many people, when that ball is hanging in the pocket, that they pound it trying to get out of there quick. If they hit it softer, the cue ball will probably actually travel greater distance. Well, there's a possibility he was trying to run into the ten and the three. Oh, that's a ball in hand. Yeah, that's a ball in hand. That's a quick shooting mistake right there. He was doing good, too. Yeah. Every shot counts in this game. He's got to break up that 9, 13, 11 cluster. And well, that 10 ball is more important, I think. That 10 ball goes nowhere. Maybe he's going to draw and knock it out here. He's going forward. Oh, no, he did. He was top the fall force into the rail and straight out and bumped the three out of the way. That was nice. Nice positional shot. He wanted to come between that ball and not touch the four, but... I thought he was going to do a little draw nip shot, but he's okay. He's got, he's got that uh, purple ball there in the side pocket. Yep. Now we'll play the uh, 15. Or the, no, or the 9. Oh, I didn't see that, yeah. Play the 9. Oh, and he's paying safety. Nope. Oh, he played the 11. That was a nice shot. Broke him up. This, this is the key shot right here. Yep. Just going to slow roll it very much, go in the middle of the table. Just don't want to run in. That's it. Too much. Oh boy. Wow. He's just got to tap this nine and he'll come right over and he, I don't know, is that ball? That 15 looks like it'll go by the eight. Yeah, that's what he's looking at. I, I, I can't, we can't I tell. I think it will. It does? I don't think it does. The monitor. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. No. <laughs> what I can see from here, it doesn't. He, he might be trying a bunch of rails. No. That's okay. He, he he didn't leave his opponent nothing. Left him flat on the rail. Which yeah. Is a tough I, shot. I, 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 he's got this one, though. He's got that nine. Okay, so. Well, i tell you what. He, he, he's got to slow roll that six ball. Nice and easy. That was a nice shot. Yeah, good shot, Mark. Played a one ball. And I think he's got a oh, seven. Well, he, he definitely has to come out with a shot. He's got to take the seven. Look at this. Oh, I thought he was going to stitch him behind the one. Still might have got him. He did stitch him behind the one. 
Now you can see the... Well, I'm talking about you can't get the nine ball. Oh, I didn't see the nine ball. I, he, I think he called it. He's just going to hit it real easy. I'm going to play a carom shot off the eight. That's okay. I like that shot. This is the game shot right here. He's got to come up with a shot right here. He's got to take that four on the side. Yeah, he doesn't make this four ball. It's over. It is. My prediction. Mm, nice shot. Nice yeah. shot. Yeah, very nice shot, Mark. Oh. Played a two ball here. Yeah, he's got to play the two. And then he'll have the one. And he'll float down for the three. Yeah. The seven. Take your time, Mark. Nice shot. Nice shot. Yeah. <laughs> okay, watch for the scratch here. Well, it's a speed shot, Chris, and he's going to take the three in the opposite side. Oh, I don't know, like that shot. Uh oh. Wow. So, how did you let the cue ball go? Well, there was no need for that. Nope. He just had to tap it in. Yeah. That's what I thought he was going to do. And play the three in the side. The other side, excuse me. Yeah, what he's going to do is he's just going to draw out of here a little bit. Get caught behind the three. That would that'd be what that would happen with me. Just come right over for the eight. Nope. Oh. I'm going to go a little wider than that. That's okay. He's going to cut it in that pocket. Let's go watch the scratch. Up here in the corner. Yep. Probably put some spin on it. Yeah, the thing is, if he overcuts it or misses it, he's not going to leave his opponent nothing. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Jeff James? If you hit that a little harder, that would have scratched. Yeah, well, uh, bad thoughts and bad shots. Uh, that was a nice match. Yeah, got another one. Jeff James, congratulations, Jeff. Uh, takes the match and... Congratulations to Mark Murphy. He was yeah, here. No, no, no shame to him. He shot really well. Yep. He made a few key mistakes and yep. Uh, yep. some fundamentals, but yep. you know, overall, he shot pretty good. Yeah.